I think given how big a cricket nasty I am uh, and was, I probably would stay in the cricket or sporting realm. Okay. Um, you know, as much as I, you know, you, you could pick any number of celebrities, but I'd probably, you know, I probably wouldn't spend too much time worrying about the cricket. So if we're actually having a net session, I've probably got to go with, you know, stick with the cricket. Yeah, yeah. Um, I love I reckon, it. I reckon first one, the one that popped up for me was I, I'd want the king now. I'd want Shane Warne there. Yeah. Um, I was lucky. I was lucky enough to play against him a couple of times, um, and he was just amazing to face. You know, from a batting perspective, I'd love, I'd love to to get him to come in and, and have a bowl. Um, and I'd actually, I wouldn't bother batting. I'd get him behind the stumps and have a keep to him because um, yeah. it's obviously something I didn't get to experience in my career. But I think that'd be pretty amazing to. Um, to see the way he operates from behind the stumps, I'd love 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 the opportunity to do that. Um, so I'll go with the king for one. Um, I reckon I was always interested. I was always really interested in in um, I guess batting and the mechanics and the mindset and just everything that goes into it. And um, you know, probably to the detriment at times in my career, and probably over over sort things at times, but. <laughs> Always, always really interested in that side of it. So I reckon for the other two, I'd probably go with I'd go with someone who's obviously a master of batting. So I reckon I'm going to go with Ricky Ponting. Yeah. Um, obviously, you know, arguably the best since Bradman um, that we've had and, and an absolute genius. So I'd go with him because I'd love to pick his brains. I did get a chance to talk to him a little bit about cricket um, on that 09 Ashes uh, weekend that I was there, but also at various times throughout my career and Always love listening to his insights, his similar with his commentary, and I think to get a chance to talk talk batting properly with him would be pretty amazing. Yeah. Um, and I'll go a little bit left field on my last one. I'll go, but in a similar vein, I'd go with probably a maybe some sort of major league baseballer, um, maybe like a Derek Jeter or something. Um, okay. For similar for similar reasons, maybe just to. Maybe just to try and understand their mindset and the, the way they operate about seeing the ball out of a out of a hand with a pitch. See if there's you know what the similarities are, what the differences are. Obviously, slightly different game, um, but a few similarities as well. So maybe interesting to see if there was anything that they do or, or um, any techniques, any mindset, things like that that, that could possibly um, you know be be paralleled into the game of cricket. Perhaps that might be interesting as well. 